It is 6.52 and here's a quick look at some of our local top stories out of Good Morning America. You can learn about the steps Aurora's police department is taking to restore public trust after an investigation found racial bias and problems with use of force after the 2019 death of Elijah McClain. Denver 7's Brandon Richard joins us live this morning because the independent monitor overseeing the changes based on the consent decree says the Aurora Police Department is doing a good job so far. Yeah, the Aurora Police Department is back on track when it comes to reforming itself. At least that's what this latest report from the independent monitor says. It's quite an improvement from the previous report. Now, the job of the independent monitor is to make sure that the city of Aurora and specifically APD is making changes to its policies and practices as part of a consent decree with the Colorado Attorney General's office. Now, this came after an investigation by the AG following the death of Elijah McClain. That investigation found APD had a pattern and practice of using racially biased policing and excessive force. The Monitor's latest report covers a period from mid-November 2022 to mid-February 2023. And the report says APD made significant progress during this time, implementing policies to address racial bias and policing, use of force, and documenting stops. It also gives a lot of credit to Aurora Interim Police Chief Art Acevedo for putting the department back on track in February after the previous report was released, showing that APD missed several deadlines. Acevedo told community members that he was committed to these reforms. We are, like Jeff said, uh, very much committed to the consent decree. I really believe the consent decree is a, uh, a, a great opportunity for this department to become a, the model agency for the nation. And tonight, Aurora citizens will have an opportunity to learn more about this latest report's findings and also to weigh in with any questions they might have at a community meeting. That community meeting is set to start at 630 at the Aurora Municipal Center. We're live this morning. Brandon Richard, Denver 7.